Hi everyone, my name is Jen. I'm from the Elyria Public Library and today we're going to go through a presentation on how to use digital media. So today's presentation will be on Hoopla and that is a digital app or website that you can visit to check out movies, books, audiobooks, music, or comic books. So I'm going to share my screen with you and we're gonna get started and we're gonna show you just how easy using Hoopla is. So if you visit Hoopla through your desktop or laptop computer, you will go to the website hoopladigital.com. If you use a tablet or smartphone, you'll have to download the app and then you're gonna log in using a valid email address and a library card. So if you have a, uh, an account already, you're gonna just log in using your email and password. If you don't, all you need is a few different things. So let's show you how to set up your account. So you're going to type in your email. You're gonna confirm your email, and then you need to choose a password that's between eight and 40 characters long. And it's gonna ask you to confirm your password as well. Then you're just gonna click on agree. And when you get to this point here, you're gonna select Elyria Public Library. If it doesn't show up, you could always search by name, or you could type in a zip code and then a list will pop up. So we're gonna click Elyria Public Library and then click next. At this point, you'll type in your library card number and click sign me up. I already have an account, so I'm gonna X here and I'm gonna sign in to my account so you can see what Hoopla looks like. Each month, you can borrow 30 items from the Elyria Public Library system that's practically one checkout for every day of the month. So that is pretty awesome. So what I'm gonna show you is what you can browse. So again, Hoopla offers audiobooks, movies, music, comics, eBooks, and TV series and seasons. So you can search everything by clicking into your search bar here at the very top, or you can browse things a little bit easier. And today we're gonna browse audiobooks. So for audiobooks and every other category, except for comics is a little bit different, and so are TV series. But you're gonna have these subcategories of recommended, featured, popular, and then Hoopla's categories, which give you some top categories that Hoopla's picking, or they give you all categories that they have. So these are just keywords that Hoopla's picked out, allow you to narrow your searching. And they're listed here in alphabetical order. And if you click on one, it'll take you to a list of their audiobooks that fit that category. Recommended comes from your checkouts. So Hoopla will start recommending right at the beginning for you. But as you check things out and use the app, it will start recommending things to you that you have um, checked out in the past, um, similar items. And it'll start recommending things that are based on your interests. So let me show you how easy it is to check an item out. So we're going to go to check out a book. And because I'm already logged in, we are all set. So let's say I want to borrow Tiger's Heart Shadow. I'm going to click borrow and it tells me how many days I have it for. That's 21 days. Every item is going to be different um, based on its type. So, but it'll tell you right here when you click on the screen how many days you have it for. So we're gonna click borrow title. And it's telling me right here at the bottom how long I have it for and how I can use it. So again, because I'm on my computer, I can only stream it. I can't download it to my computer. If you have your tablet or a smartphone, you'll be able to download it and use it without your Wi-Fi. So my Hoopla will show all of my borrows and it'll show that item that we just borrowed, which is right down here. And it tells you how many days you have it left for. So Hoopla is as simple as that. Um, tune in next time where we will go through a more advanced Hoopla 
checkout process, as well as setting some of your settings and other features that Hoopla offers, like a kids mode and advanced search. Thank you for watching, everyone. Have a great day.